welcome home. Living in America. Still talking about affordable housing while living here in America. And we are wanting ourselves some affordable rent if we could get it. And guess what? If we put our names on these lists, it's a possibility that we will have ourselves some affordable housing sooner than later. Some of the lists are longer than others in certain states, but it is worth waiting on, guys. It is worth waiting on. So what we are is we're a community here trying to prevent and pre reduce homelessness one person at a time starting here with us right here as i say guys it's going to take us and so what i need you to do is every time i come on here is to press the like button so we can hope that this video spreads to others so our seniors our homeless our families out there our veterans our disabled can get affordable housing all right that's what we want we want them to have affordable housing so if i happen to say a state that you guys are willing to move to or know someone willing to move to pass the video along okay that is it pressing the like button and passing the video along of course you can buy me a coffee also too it's in the description if you want to but that's what i ask you guys to do kindly okay today we're going to talk about two states we're going to talk about the state of minnesota and we're going to talk about the state of michigan they have been coming up quite a few times in the last couple months lately all right so they have some other things that have come available all i ask you to do is to do your due diligence before placing yourself on a list guys you want to check out the units the property and you want to check out the surroundings and see if it will be a good fit for you and your family all right while you wait on your housing choice vouchers a lot of times housing choice vouchers are uh, in these videos a good majority of the time um, but here coming up lately there's a lot of public housing and that is okay too so what we have right now is we have Dakota County Minnesota they have a section 8 waiting list open until further notice guys they have it for a housing choice voucher just what we were talking about just where people are wanting all right also South Scott County, CDA, Scott County, Minnesota, Rural Development Housing Waiting List is open until further notice, guys. That's big. It's, it's game-changing. It's life-changing. And how is that? Because it helps our family to have better lifestyles when we can save some money. So save some money on rent and do something else with that money that you need to support your family with, okay? So let's see. Also, Scott County, Minnesota Section 8 project-based vouchers are open, and they have three, four, and five bedrooms units open at this time, and the waiting list will remain open until further notice. So that is big. Let me just um, find out if there's any other information. Let's go to Dakota County and see if they have any criteria or anything like that. It doesn't state anything right now so you just want to contact their housing authority there in dakota county they have some public housing available at portland biscayne townhomes and colleen lonely manor all right so that's the information for dakota contact the housing authority over there let's look at uh, scout county public housing it's called Scott, Scott County over there. It doesn't give a whole lot of information. So like I said, you want to just call the housing authority and find out what you need. So good deal. Guys, if you need any other support, you can also look at Mama Cutie Finance. She talks about Section 8 and the affordable housing waiting room. Those sisters on YouTube, they talk about affordable housing. And they are dedicated and committed to helping you get your vouchers all right so they give you guidelines and tips over there so if you want extra support you can check them out tell them i sent you tell them i sent you tell them i sent you all right so battle creek housing commission we're talking about battle creek michigan right now they have a section 8 albion waiting list and it's going to open soon so we're really early for this one 
this one will open on September the 9th, 2024, guys, and it will remain open for a good amount of time, four days, until September the 13th, 2024, guys. All right, so you can actually apply online at the Battle Creek Housing Commission, so check Battle Creek Mission Housing Authority. Let me see if it is ha has any other information. I know they have uh, public housing at Parkway Manor there. They have 88 units available. They have Battle Creek Turnkey um, available. 52 units and Cherry Hill Manor is open for their public housing there. So just go ahead and check with the Battle Creek Housing Commission, guys. If you know anything about these properties, please let us know your YouTube family in the comments. Let us know any information, anything that I missed, anything that you want to say that would be useful and beneficial for all of us, okay? I love you guys. Make sure you become a subscriber because I do these videos weekly, sometimes a couple times a day, sometimes a couple times a week, but I do these videos weekly. So I want to make sure that you know what is out there so make sure that you become a subscriber and tell all your friends and family who need affordable housing so they can pass it on to people as well because I have been putting these videos out here lately they're not being spread to as many people but we need this to spread to people I am putting this out here and people need to have this information if you're not watching it then no one's getting the information at all all right that's just really really sad okay because these things that i'm giving you give i give you you know ideas on different things that's out there different things that's coming open i i have things that are about to uh, be built they're not section eight but they are low income apartments different things like that that i am getting uh, wind of resources of and people telling me about so you just never know so tell your friends and families okay get the homeless off the street the people that want to be in a home our seniors our veterans our military our disabled our families okay that's what we want i love you guys and i'll see you next time all right goodbye